Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Boohoo sent me two big bags full of clothes. So in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys what I picked up from Boohoo, what I chose from their website, and I'm gonna be trying it on. I really hope you enjoy today's video. If you do, smash a big thumbs up, subscribe as well if you haven't already, and let's crack on with the video. I am not even gonna speak for a second. I'm just gonna let you watch and admire as I show you this beautiful cut. Okay, it's a little bit big. Can I fit it all in the shot? Way there we go. So the first thing I chose was this beautiful faux fur leopard print cut. I actually cannot deal with this cut. It is, oh my God, look at me. Oh my God, I just wanna hibernate in this cut so bad. So it's a really, really long cut. It's one of the huge ones that's in fashion right now. And I honestly cannot tell you how warm, cozy and amazing this feels it doesn't have any buttons or anything to tie it so it's literally just like you throw it on and this is it hello but I cannot get enough of it this just feels like the softest thing ever it's like wearing a teddy bear but it's got two very handy pockets here and here pow pow big old collar as well so it keeps your neck nice and warm when you're stood waiting for a bus or something along those lines comment down below if you love this as much as me like this is gonna be my new autumn obsession if anybody comments on this video and says i look like pat butcher because she wears these coats this is all i have to say just know i don't look like pat butcher as much as my dad said i did i look very fashionable and cool i love it so the next piece that i actually wanted to show you i'm gonna take this coat off because we do not need it anymore was this little outfit that i've got on right now I love it. I've just moved the camera down slightly so you can see the outfit as a whole. Can we take a minute to appreciate this outfit? So I'm gonna break it down a little bit. Break it down now, y'all. One time. So I'll start with this dress actually because it'll be easier. But it's this little corduroy dress. You can see the material there when I come up close. It's a really, really nice, soft corduroy material. And it's actually got a little kangaroo pouch in the front as well, which if I just test it with my phone, practical in every way possible. It's a really nice length as well. It's like midi, just cuts off below my knee. It's got two huge pockets, which is great for like looking all cool. This is what it looks like at the back. I just think it's really, really nice. Very easy to style because you can literally just whack on a t-shirt, a long sleeve t-shirt like this. You could even wear a jumper. Mixing it up a little bit. It's got these two buttons here as well, so you could have it a little bit tighter. I actually don't think I could fit into the tighter one because it would be a bit you know, like that. But whilst I've undone a button, I'm gonna show you the top underneath because I didn't actually know how I was gonna style this because I was like a little bit like a thermal top, but honestly, it's the nicest little top ever. I'm just gonna take it out of the dress so you can see how long it is. It's like that, so you could kind of wear it just like that if you wanted to, or as I would style it, I'd probably put on some high waist jeans or with this pinafore dress, just something over the top. It's really nice to style with other stuff, but yeah, it's so, so nice. It's got this little brown bit at the neck as well and on the cuffs and inside wait till you see this it's like this fleecy material and it's so so soft it feels a little bit like a thermal top i'm living for that because it's friggin freezing outside it genuinely feels like winter next up is this little boiler suit and it's so cute <gasps> was that a rhyme boiler suit and it's so cute I'm a poet and I didn't know it. So this is what it looks like. I got it in this rust colour. And they also had it in like a sage colour. Is it sage? Basically like a really light bluey green colour. Um, but I went for this because I thought it was more autumnal. It's full length leg, I think. And it's got this contrast stitching on everywhere, which, which I think looks really, really nice. By the way, BTW got it in a size 10. So let's try it on. Ta-da! This is what it looks like. Okay, so thoughts, thoughts. I'm just testing the movability. Mobility out of 10, I would say it's about a six. I feel like my arm movability can't go any further than this. And my leg movability, my legs are not going any further than that, guys. I'm not going to lie. But I think for when I'd actually wear this, I don't reckon I'd need to move a lot, to be honest. I actually think this is super cute. I think it's very on trend. It's a little bit of a statement piece as well because of the colour. It's quite bright. It does fit me quite nicely as well. Like the arms are perfect lengthwise, as are the legs. As you can see here, as I levitate my leg. 
Okay, that was a fail. But yeah, I love the contrast stitching. I think that looks super cute. I think this might actually look cute with a little black bell. I think that would bring the outfit together a lot and make it look a lot better. But I don't have my brown bell here, so I can't try it on. Question. Oh my God, are they real pockets? Yes, they are. Let's do the usual test. Da, 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 so the next thing I picked up was a puffer coat, just like a black puffer coat. I'm gonna try it on for you as I talk you guys through it. So it's super oversized, perfect for winter. It's just one of those really nice, warm, wintery coats that's black so it's easy to style. I'm gonna see how high it can go. Okay, there we go. This is a great little bonus, the fact that it's got a hood. Oh my God, this is so nice. Yeah, looking cool feeling cool but on a style or fashionable note let's get the zip undone let's get the hood down let's bring it out and make it look a little bit more cool oh my god i actually think it goes with this spoiler suit as well you know i actually bought a black puffer coat about two years ago and i've worn it for a good two winters and it was not as good as this at all it didn't have a hood for a start the material was definitely worse quality i feel like a lot of puffer coats nowadays because they came in fashion last year and maybe even the year before but definitely this year they are gonna be in fashion i feel like everyone is gonna have a puffer coat a lot of them don't have a lot of poof if you know what i mean they're kind of a little bit flabby but this one is definitely full of like material and it feels really puffy i don't know this is what you'd want in a puffer coat and it's very oversized i just wanted to check the size so i got size 10 which is my normal size and it's actually really oversized this coat i'm pretty sure it said on the website that it was oversized but just for reference like definitely go for the size that you are if you want it to style like this i definitely wouldn't size up next up we have a dress and i never wear dresses apart from if i really 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 have to i picked up this leopard print dress how cute is that i actually chose one that was a little bit different but they'd run out of stock so they sent me this one because it was similar just a little backstory for you there and i actually like this i don't know how it's gonna look on me because i've literally never tried on a dress like this i don't think because it's all like elasticated at the top and then the arms are quite puffy um and it is a short dress as well so my legs are gonna be out just a bit of a pre-warning before i do try this on i've not fake tanned anywhere on my body including my legs they're very pale pale as so just bear that in mind for the next clip because i'm gonna look pale now 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 what are we saying what are we saying i think this looks all right actually i didn't think it was gonna suit me but but i mean i'm not saying i look stunning but i would say that it looks quite cute and i really like the leopard print i mean i just love leopard print can you tell oh my god imagine if i wore this dress with this coat oh my god I look like an actual leopard. Oh my God, I could literally camouflage into anything right now. Anyway, back to the dress. I really like this bit here. I think this looks really, really cute. Like this little ruffle bit here. I love the arms as well. They're a little bit see-through. You can see my arm through it a little bit, which is really nice. I like that a lot. Next up is a jumper. Oh my goodness, how nice. It's really oversized. It's got these huge baggy balloon arms. It's got a really nice turtleneck kind of top. And they had this in three different colors. They had it in a black cream and then this dusty blue color. And I went for this because I don't have a jumper like this in this color or this style. And I just really wanted to try it. The material is really nice as well. You can see it there. Just a really nice cozy material. So I'm gonna style this with a little skirt. So I really wanted to wear this out the other day, but I've been waiting to film this video before I wear anything outdoors so i'm so excited to try this one on so this is what it looks like oh my god i actually love this so much it's very oversized and baggy like literally if i just stretch my arms out that is how long the sleeves go although it's oversized i still think it fits me really nicely it's really nice up here at the neck it'd keep you really warm i've styled it with this skirt although now i've got the two pieces together I'm not actually sure if the colors go very well together i think i would style this with like a black or a gray color rather than a warmer color so in terms of styling tips I think this would look really nice with like a leather skirt or something. A black leather skirt. <gasps> that would look so nice. Definitely a 10 out of 10 for this jumper. Can't say anymore. 
I just love it. I just love it. Next up is this wine coloured midi dress. It's super simple. It's just like a slip dress in this really, really nice dark red burgundy colour. This feels so soft. I cannot wait to style this with a t-shirt. I feel like that is my go-to thing. Like if in doubt, just stick a t-shirt on underneath and you'll be fine. So I'm going to do that exact thing with this. So I actually didn't realise this until I've tried it on. It's got two slits down each side on the leg. I was actually imagining this with some black tights, but now that it's got the slit, I mean it's always had the slit, but I just didn't realise. I probably wouldn't wear this with tights anymore. I would just stick on some Doc Martens and then this little t-shirt I've got on, which is really cute. The only thing I would say with this is that it is a little bit see-through. You can literally see my t-shirt underneath the whole thing. So if you're having a bloated day or a day when you just don't feel like wearing something slightly see-through, this dress is not for those days. But any other day, this dress is your one. Oh my god, guys, we are on to the last item of clothing. Worry not, worry not, I've got a few little extra bits that I want to show you guys. So the last thing I went for was this oversized t-shirt dress. I got it in brown because I don't actually have any brown t-shirts, I don't think. So I went for brown because it was a bit something different. It's this soft, really smooth material, which I don't think I own anything in this either, but I'm very excited to try this on. I think I might have to wear a belt with it because an oversized t-shirt might just look a bit meh but we will see we will see oh before i try it on i got this in a size 10 as well and this dress is in a size 10 as well everything is in a size 10 okay so as expected i definitely would need a bell or something on this to kind of jazz it up a little bit and to definitely pull me in at the waist as well but just so you can see it in real life this is what this dress looks like it's really long it's like a midi dress which is really nice i think i would wear this in autumn and winter to be honest i think this would look cute with an oversized jumper over the top and then kind of having this as a skirt i actually think that would work a lot. So although we finished with all the clothing items, they did kindly gift me some beauty items as well. So I've got a few little bits of stuff to show you. Just a few little bits and bobs. So the first thing were these Yes Tuck Grapefruit Brightening Wipes with Vitamin C in. They are glow boosting. <gasps> I'm so excited to use these. I've actually used Yes To wipes before. I think it was the cucumber ones that I used and they were really nice. I got this and I believe this is a little face massager. I've seen Jamie Genevieve, Gen Genevieve? Genevieve, use this in her videos and I think it's to get rid of uh, like redness in your skin and stuff. I'm not actually 100% sure so I'm gonna have to do my research on this but if you've got any tips on how to use this little piece of machinery let me know in the comments because I would appreciate your advice. I also got gifted these, a little bit of a pamper gift. They're just not gonna stay on my eyes, are they? These are gonna be so nice when I've got a face mask on, which if you've watched me for a while and you follow me on Instagram, you will know that I use face masks like a lot. And when I say a lot, I mean a couple of times a week. So these are gonna be perfect. Speaking of face masks, they also gifted me these Crystal Collagen Gold Powder Eye Masks. Look at those. They look very exciting. And last but not least is a little makeup brush. This is a little eye blending brush, I believe. Let's give it a little test. Ooh, it feels really soft. I'm actually in need of a little blending brush as well, so this has come at the perfect time. The packaging looks like Morphe packaging. That's exactly what it reminds me of. Or maybe Zoeva. Okay, you guys, that brings us to the end of today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much again to Boohoo for gifting me all of these clothes. I really, really am grateful. Dreams really do come true, kids. Thank you so, so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you next week for another exciting video. Bye, guys.